Attention. Please put on your earphones. Test begins in 5, 4, 3, 2... Attention all flight crew members, this is the final go-no-go no go poll for operations. Raptor 1. Raptor 1's go. Raptor 2. Go. Stage 1. Go. Stage 2. Go. Flight director is go for launch. We have lift off. Vehicles pitching downrange. The clip you just saw is arguably the greatest feat ever occurred in the history of humanity till now. You may be wondering what this is all about. It's better if you hear it from the horse's mouth. Uh, I mean, there's a custom built tower with uh, arms that'll, that are designed to catch the, the largest and heaviest flying object ever made. SpaceX, founded and led by Elon Musk, has successfully captured a super heavy booster through the custom built tower. Okay, in layman's terms, they have just captured a freaking rocket in mid-air that is bigger than a multi-story building or a skyscraper. This is mind-boggling and phenomenal because this may be the tipping point of using spacecrafts as aeroplanes, but this time beyond Earth. So to simply put, SpaceX Starship is a fully reusable spacecraft and launch vehicle that is designed to transport crew and cargo to various destinations including Earth orbit, the moon and of course the ultimate destination for the modern day Iron Man, Mars. It is intended to enable long duration interplanetary flights with a crew of up to 100 people. It will also be capable of point to point transport on Earth enabling you to travel anywhere in the world in less than an hour. Yes, less than an hour anywhere in the world. It's quite inspiring to see how SpaceX went from this in 2002 to this at the contemporary period. Let me share some fascinating trivia with you, okay? There's a scale called Kardashev scale that is used to classify civilizations on the basis of their technological and scientific progress as type 1, type 2 and so on till type 6. There are other versions to it but generally it ranges from type 1 to type 6. You may be wondering where does our human civilization come into this scale, come into this picture. It doesn't even rank type 1. Type 1 civilization is basically the one which can harness and store all of the energy potential present on its planet. We are very much regressive here, but ventures like SpaceX Starship is changing that. I plan to elaborate further on the Kardashev scale and its various types of civilizations in my upcoming videos. So for that I would appeal for you to please follow up the channel. And along with that, there are some exciting videos coming up next year. Stories like that of SpaceX Starship are the ones we should actually celebrate irrespective of wherever we live on planet Earth because these are the events that will level our status on the Kardashev scale. This will what make humanity expand beyond the boundaries of the past and get truly in alignment in becoming of an intergalactic civilization. That's a term in the technical world called as bleeding edge which refers to the very forefront of technical progress and development. So you may be wondering, SpaceX Starship is pushing for the bleeding edge or is advocating for the bleeding edge? No my friends, SpaceX Starship is the bleeding edge.